How is Bernie Sanders' health during his run for the 2020 presidency? He is like... Good evening, my friends. Another video we are going to do, but in meanwhile, Lashak did the video with me that he was interviewing me and asking me naughty questions. <laughs> that was not prepared. They weren't that naughty. Yeah, well, crazy. And you can find them on his uh, website. Uh, he has already two videos there. <laughs> so yeah. it, he will post the name Illuminati. Monaco. <laughs> Illumination Monaco. Oh, sorry, Illumination Monaco. He had that in his dream. So. <laughs> okay. Um, first question. You don't know these questions. How is Bernie Sanders' health during his run for the 2020 presidency? It's like I see a spider web. I think he is like antenna picking up every energy possible. Oh yeah. I think he can accumulate every energy because spider in the web. Well, it's it's his place to be. For, for any other animal, it's a disaster. But for the spider, it's like he can accumulate more and more energy because he is a spider. And There is a phenomenon like that. People go on stage and they just feel this but rush. Trump has the same thing. Yeah. He's addicted because he is getting energy. Uh, to, uh, over a year ago, two years one and a half year ago, I burned myself. Mm -hmm. And I'm so bad with any scarring. I don't have even nothing, mm -hmm. nothing. And it was like very bad, red and big blister. Yeah. People were sending me good energy. And thank you everyone. It heals that there is not even a mark, nothing, nothing. So it is the phenomenon of people that are receiving a good energy, mm -hmm. if they can connect with that. Well, that makes a lot of sense. I, for I think because I could, I was amazed how well it's healed and we get it. We get it. Of course, he's always cutting me short, <laughs> but. Um, that kind of explains my next question because, you know, Michael Cohen claimed that Trump didn't even want to be president in the first place. But he also, in the same breath, he said, you know, uh, if Trump loses the 2020 election, there will not be a peaceful transition of power. Is he correct about there not being a peaceful transition of power in 2020? Does, what, what does he know? Hold my hands. I know we don't need that, but... Does Michael know Trump is intending to create chaos if he loses? I know once I said that the flag is flat. But this one is like being in MRI tube. You never been. You never have done MRI. I was a welder, so I can't. Okay, but I was. Um, once they make a fake ID that I might have a cancer, so they make me uh, MRI, and uh, that tube. He will be not able to do anything because in that tube you are not able to move. You have to be still. It's like seduce. They don't give you anything, but you have to be still. Yeah. I don't think you will be able to, to do anything crazy because they will, he will be in the place that he wouldn't have any 
way to, to influence anything. But it is about half an hour treatment. But it's a very you loud ca- noise. It is very loud so noise. there could be a loud noise around him where he is... But he will be isolated. He will be stiff, like not moving, nothing. It's unpleasant. Well, it's nothing unpleasant. Will there be chaos? Outside? Outside, regardless of anything he does. Those crazy people will be walking with the signs and so on, so it will be spread movement of those white supremacists because I see them with the torches. But I don't think they will reach to the point that they will be a threat. Will there be any mass shootings or... Will there, will, will there be any mass shootings or bombs or anything? Those rotten thieves, yes. They will have to eliminate them eventually, but they, they are like a rotten <laughs> thie- uh, thief. Yeah. And everyone you have to eliminate one by one, so there will be people who will be crazy and rotten, and they will be doing those crazy things. So then Democrats in power, like you said um, in the previous reading, the um, they will definitely use those situations to pass gun control, right? What do you, what do you see for gun control? Las Vegas, and in Las Vegas there was that huge social thing, and nothing happened after that when this guy killed so many people it will still be hard to reach them. Because I see a lot of symbols of, from Las Vegas. They will be still in power to control the Senate and not letting the, the gun control to be the way that, that it's supposed to be. Uh-huh. I'm sorry, but it looks like that the, those idiots will still have access to to the mass. So, Venezuelan President Nicolas Maduro blamed the U.S. for attacking the power system. And he also blamed his rival, uh, the interim president, that he was associated to the power grid going mm-hmm. down. Um, is he right about the U.S. attacking the Venezuelan power system? Black and white, black and white, and it's like playing chess. It's a strategic move. It is some strategic moves, and you don't know who is the black, who is the white. Can you go through the cards? It's the game that they are playing with each other. And now Americans are supposed to leave the country, and they don't have even ability to learn about that because there is no electricity. To flag the, the radio too. So Americans are moving all the politicians from uh, from Venezuela, and sometimes that's a symbol of war. A, of a war because they don't want to have the people. But if that's Americans are behind this, why wouldn't they inform their own people to leave the country? In Poland, when there was a martial law, you were just born two months old, they were disconnecting the electricity every few hours. Every few hours we were in darkness. And no water as well. (laughs) And it was for a long time. I think of uh, two years, that was all the time. The game, is there water? Oh, no power. You grab the candle and you walk with it. So finally people get upset. No, people couldn't do anything because they had the the army. And uh, Maduras, he has the army. 
So the, the one who has the army, then that one has the power. These cars don't look that bad. No, they don't look that bad. Actually, everyone will be very cautious what they are doing. Someone is playing stupid games. Families, families will be reunited. And they, those people in Venezuela, they have to reunite with the people who are working for the government. Beginning of the, it's already not that new movement, but it's going after the new movement and changing direction. So they want to change direction of the country. Everything looks actually that Maybe Maduras was uh, playing with that electricity. That's what I'm thinking, yeah. And it might backfire on him. Because yeah. even those army people, they need fridges. Yeah. <laughs> and well, they yeah. need food. And you've already said that it will be a, a transition of power. Yeah, well, I like said that, that I saw the monuments going down. Yeah. So. So. Uh, here's an interesting question from Celia Torres. Do pets reincarnate back to you? I bet I already know what you're going to say. Well, Sometimes. I think I have my reincarnation of Vivi from my first dog. So I have that feeling. And I saw a lot of strings from um, Cloud going down to the earth so who knows my first dog was queenie and oh not queenie uh, chica and now i have vivi and vivi is so cuddly so adorable so smart <laughs> absolutely um so we have an older dog but uh, she's very old so she has problem with her hips the full house actress Lori lachlan who played Rebecca, surrendered to the FBI and is in custody over college bribery charges. Yeah. I mean, I don't see it being a big thing because any wealthy parent with a dumb kid would do the same. And she has no dumb kid. It's just the daughter doesn't feel that the study is important. She wants to go to college for, general, for, for partying. <laughs> no, I, I've seen her daughter. She looks exactly like... I, I haven't seen her. Daughter. No, it's beautiful. Yeah, but yeah, I've seen YouTube videos. How is Rebecca or how is uh, Lori Laughlin doing right now? She's lucky she has her husband. And they have a very good marriage and they were together in, a, in that hole. It wouldn't, she knows that there is a lot of drama, a lot of fire, but then she will be more, more famous because of that. Uh -huh. That's my second question. It, I feel that, uh, you know what, no one is putting her uh, on the same legal problems that Manafort had today and her. She was doing the best thing for her child. I know it's a crime, I know. But I, I can't blame good parents to, to go to that extent. And I know it, it's not legal. But Kushner's father did the same thing. Trump's father did the same the thing. The same thing. So a lot of it's those... It's been documented that he paid money to the yes, school that Yes, and Trump everyone was doing that. I... Uh, I was one ask one lady if she will get to Harvard, and she was a very good student. She already had one degree from Harvard, and she wanted to go for another one. And I said they are buying those places, and she was kind of puzzled if that's not the true. So it was much harder to get for her the seat that she deserved in school. Uh -huh. Because other people were able to bribe. You mean she was puzzled? She didn't believe that other people were paying their way? <sighs> she kind of... She didn't want to believe that that's the way. 
Mm -hmm. But that came through the reading that time, and I was, even it was Harvard University. Well, yeah, that's Harvard's one of those schools. One listed. of them, <laughs> and but Yale as well, Yale as well. So there was a lot of good schools on that list yesterday. And so the the next question: How will this event impact her career? You said she'll be more famous, but what about her career? Actually, more flame. You see flame? She will have more flame. Good, I like her. <laughs> yeah, and the other pair as well, good parents, good marriage. I feel sorry. I feel very sorry for those parents that they went for that, that way. But to them, that's a child and they want to. I know I will have a lot of comments that I shouldn't stand up for those people, but sorry. It's we the never did of that. The parent, though. We never did that for you. You, you had didn't to, have to. <laughs> you had to mature yourself and know what you want. <laughs> and he was a very good student at college. Mm -hmm. Okay, thank you so much. And please subscribe. And watch Leszek's video, if, uh, Leszek's YouTube channel. And see you next time. Thank you. Bye-bye. I would like to invite you to the private reading with me. Please visit www.psychicvioletta.com Click book online. Choose the type of reading. Choose the length. Choose the date and the time. Fill out your informations. Click the Pay Now button with your credit card or debit card. And you're all done!